how to make an animated background inside DaVinci Resolve. I'm inside DaVinci in the edit tab and I'm going in the effects library, typing fusion composition and dragging and dropping it onto my timeline. Then you want to right click on it and select open in fusion page. Once inside you want to add background from here and then connect it to your media out. You can then highlight background and go in specter and change the color of the background. I'm keeping mine on black. While background note is highlighted, you want to select control spacebar to open the tools, with effects, type grid and select the top result. Click on add. After grid is highlighted, go to the inspector and you can reduce the roll cells to a values of 8 and columns for a value of 12. Then you can reduce the values of 0 to major line spacing and beneath that you can change the color of that grid. I'm putting mine on red. Then you can go to the settings bar which is next to controls and reduce the amount of blend, this is basically the opacity, so I'm keeping mine on half on a values of 0.5. I'm planning to have something over the background so I don't need it to be that bright. While the grid node is highlighted you can then control spacebar again and type waviness, then click on add, highlight it and go in the specter. Onto the scale you can put a values of approximately 4 for example and then on strength again values of 4. Then you can go down on speed and this is also up to you, I like to keep mine very slow on the values of 0.05. So onto speed I'm typing 0.05 speed and then moving to the next step and this is by adding another waviness, control spacebar and I'm adding the same note. I'm going this time and changing the position to horizontal and then putting again a values of 4 both on size and the strength. Speed remains on 0.05 and this is the final resolve. Nice and smooth grid for background of your videos. I hope it was helpful. You can also watch this video right here. I'm pretty sure you're gonna like it. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.